head into Cinderella's Royal Table for lunch. Let's go! This is the Royal Elevator. Oh yeah, go ahead. Headed into the round elevator. Going to. It's directed by the Royal staff. Here's our place setting. Here is the menu. There's a very nice beverage selection. Here are the appetizers. There are the entrees. Here are the finales. Now, the toughest part is going to be to decide what we want to eat out of all this deliciousness. So, Lisa decided to go with the sangria. That looks really refreshing right now. And I just went with iced tea.
Um, I will say that the potatoes were a little salty. It seemed to be um, some type of bacon or something like that in there. Um, but other than that, absolutely amazing. And I always get my sauces on the side just because sometimes it's a little bit smothered. And I prefer to just add my own or dip it a little bit. How was your chicken? Actually, I asked for the chicken with no seasoning and they did a really great job with it. Um, so I didn't have any issues. Again, just like Jen said, the potatoes were some kind of a seasoning I didn't really like. But um, other than that, very nice. Would you recommend the chicken? I would recommend the chicken. And if you have an issue with any of the, not all the meats still do it, but certain things they can um, make it a uh, special order. So I just talked to the chef. I'm not the only one. It happens all the time. Don't be shocked. And I didn't say anything about the salad yet, um, about the appetizers. The salad was good, but I tried Lisa's potato soup, and that was even better. So if you like soup, um, the reason I got the salad is because it's really hot out today. So a lot of times I'll get salad versus soup to cool off a little bit. But I wanted to try the salad, give it a chance. It was very good, but I probably wouldn't get it again. So what did you think of your potato soup? What did you think about the uh, potato soup? Potato soup was delicious. It did have a little, a little bit of a salty edge, but so I ate about half of it. So, but very, very flavorful. Very good texture, smooth. I would recommend it. So we're having a great time. We've met all the princesses. All the princesses are in the house or the castle. Very nice. So we're enjoying our meal. We're chilling a little bit, getting out of the heat. And hopefully you guys are enjoying this experience as much as we are. This is the clock strikes 12. And that is really a beautiful presentation. I can't wait to try it. Who's our chef? Oh. He's checking on everybody, which is really nice. He came by and checked on our meal, and I told him it was delicious. And he said, you're the one without the seasoning, are you? <laughs> this is almond cheesecake. The specialty decor. I'm gonna try that. And I believe it's called almond crust. crust it. It's a little crunchy on the outside. What is that called? Hibiscus meringue. As in the flour? Yes. Different than the um food. It looks so amazing. Good. How does it compare? It's just similar to our pieces, but I have to say our pieces is better. Is it? Because of the the actual pieces of like it's yeah, like the it's sliced almonds. Mm -hmm. Okay. Would you get it again here? I'm gonna try the chocolate as well. Okay, try the chocolate. I'm pick the chocolate. I'd pick the chocolate too. This is a flower, no. an edible flower, and these are raspberries. Yeah, it's definitely dark. And this is white chocolate. I can't believe that. Go ahead and try it. Go ahead and try it. Now that you've destroyed my beautiful dessert. Go ahead. Oh, time. And Disney, there is no time. That's a special castle clock. Mmm. 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 White chocolate is really good. That's the best if you like chocolate. Here's some, I believe this is called raspberry coulis. Mm. <clears throat> I would like to try one of the meringue. Here. These are the best ones. This? Yeah. Mm. Yeah, that's good. Let me try your own. Um, What's the fruit on the top? I think I might eat peaches. Did you try one? You don't like it? It's all right. Uh-oh. It just, I don't know, it's something with that consistency. Okay. <laughs> Going back to this one. That's the reaction I had. Yeah, it, it is good. It, it's funny because... It doesn't count. The initial bite, I didn't like it. Yeah. 
But as it sits in your mouth for a second, you taste the amaretto. Okay, so this is our receipt after dining at Cinderella's Royal Table. And we've used our dining plan. This particular restaurant is actually two dining credits. This is a signature dining experience. So they deducted two per person, and we now have 16 coupons remaining. We had an awesome dining experience here at Cinderella's Royal Table, and we'll see you on our next Raptor Adventure. Make a wish.